People react to stressors differently and lymphoma patients are no exception. Uh, probably you will be shocked initially to know about your diagnosis of lymphoma and it takes a while for you to get accustomed to this new stage of life. However, uh, we do encourage you to talk to others, talk to your friends and family so that you can share your feelings and you can unburden yourself. As psychiatrists, we support patients with lymphoma and their family members if they are having difficulties. After the initial period of shock, the various time points where um, people need professional help could be related to, you know, procedural anxiety about coming to the hospital on several locations and having side effects to various treatments and you get scared. So somebody might be scared of coming for treatment and have symptoms of nausea even before they have actually received the chemotherapy in that cycle. So uh, that we would consider as a procedural anxiety. Some patients might go on to have pervasive sort of sustained low mood or uh, reduced sleep, appetite and symptoms suggestive of depression. Now if these symptoms continue and is disabling yourself after common sense lifestyle modifications like you know having a regular routine, engaging in leisure activities, speaking to friends and families, if possible ask your doctors how good is it for you to do some light exercise. You may, if these symptoms continue, you may need to see a mental health professionals like ourselves. We first see you, assess you by talking to you and it's customary to talk to a family member who could be able to give some information about you and we make a diagnosis. Following that, depending on the kind, kind of conditions you're having, common conditions could be depression or anxiety or the adjustment disorder, you might be better even with just psychological treatment. Some patients require medications for a few months and this is monitored by psychiatrists like us. So uh, for patients with lymphoma, the suggestion we would be that, you know, you see how you react to the stress and if needed, um, consult a uh, consultant psychiatrist or a psychologist in the cancer hospital where you will be being treated if emotions are being overwhelming for yourself. Most patients get better from depression and anxiety because these are absolutely curable and treatable conditions. So you will be fine after a few weeks or months. Once your lymphoma is better, you have to go back to your normal life. Some patients feel after they are better when they are joining back for work, um, what if their lymphoma comes back? This we call as fear of recurrence. This also needs to be dealt by professionals, how you could have alternate thoughts and make, you know, make progress in getting back to your day-to-day -day life. So during the trajectory from the diagnosis, during treatment and following recovery, when you go back to your life, it's important to focus on your physical and well as well as your mental health.